Hey there, it's Julie Broad with Revenue.com and I'm going to answer the question that's been coming up a lot because we're in February and property assessments have come out all over the place and people are wondering if their property assessment is a good indicator of the value of their property today. The short answer, no. The long answer is that there's a whole lot of reasons why the, in our case, BC assessment will tell you that it's a good indicator of value and that they've done all this research. But it's not really what you would get if you put your house on the market today. We went through all of our properties. We have a good sized portfolio, so it's a decent sample. And I think two of them, we're, we're close to what we thought we could get if we sold our properties today. One property in particular, which is worth at least $410,000, was assessed for three hundred and eighteen. dollars uh, Another one, which we would be lucky to sell for three twenty dollars right now, was assessed for three forty-four. dollars So there's definitely some significant variance in some of these properties. That's just two examples. We found most of them were off by twenty, thirty thousand dollars $30,000 from what we thought we could sell. Not horrible, right? That's within about 10% of their value in most cases. So it's a decent indicator but it's not an accurate assessment. And there's lots of reasons why. First of all, when was the last time someone from your local assessment body actually physically came in and inspected the property? That means it's not accounting for the current condition. So if you've done a lot of beautiful upgrades or you've let it get run down, that's not reflected. What it looks at is, first of all, lot size, building size, you know, data, how many bedrooms, et cetera, how many bathrooms. Uh, but it also does that, oh, it also looks at building permits. So your, your local assessor will pull building permits and if you've done any work that required a permit, that will be accounted. So you might see an increase in your assessment if you've added a legal suite, for example. But all of this is based on comparable sales. But the sale data is as of July 1st of the previous year. So here we are in February. Do you think the market's doing something different than what it was up to July 1st of the year before? Many years, there's dramatic differences in that six to eight month time period. So the assessments are, are significantly off because there's been jumps or drops. Now here in Nanaimo, it's not that much different than what was happening in July. So it's not a bad reflection, but again, it's not a perfect valuation of your property, partly because there's been no physical inspection, but also because it's, well, out of date. Right? It's as of July 1st of the year before. So you can look at assessment data and it does give you an indicator of where the overall area has probably gone, whether prices have gone down or gone up in your market area. Now, one thing I will give you a little tip on, a BC assessment, and I'm sure this is the case in many other provinces, allows you to access assessment data for your properties and the properties around it. So what a great time to add more information to your market area research. Check out your property, see what the properties around it have sold for, what they're assessed for, and start to understand why there are differences. All right? enjoy enjoy this is not available all year round it's just a period of time i think bc assessment allows it allows you access to this until the end of march or sometime in april while they go through dispute resolutions and things like that so check that out check out the rest of our videos if you have other real estate investing questions that are not answered in one of our videos go ahead post it if you're in youtube go ahead post it right there if you're reading our revenue newsletter from revenue.com i hope you are you can just reply to one of those newsletters with your question and I just might shoot a video for you. All right, see you again next time. Take care. <laughs>